Hello, everybody. Um, I did a video back in August about the update of the COVID-19. And now I'm going to do another update of the COVID. This fucking COVID bullshit. This low-class generation of making people think that it's the end of the world. It is the end of the world because... In the video I did the last time, um, I was I didn't have a job, but now I do. So now I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing a update for a second update to the coronavirus. So here's how I see COVID for the last nine months. First of all, when people break the guidelines from the fucking CDC and the and the guidelines that are the ex um, head doctors trying to do and have every fucking people every fucking person in the, in the United States get tested for COVID I mean I mean this this is not okay I mean it's 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 going to be one fucking disgrace to society. It's like someone has a privilege. It's like having the privilege that if we broke it, it's going to be gone. It's going to be gone until people find out what a pandemic is and see why, why a pandemic it's not okay to go fucking clubbing, to go fucking partying, drink, drinking alcohol when people s discriminate them because they can't drink alcohol and all that other bullshit. They're just people freaking out. They're just thinking they're children or babies saying that it's the end of the road. It's like, oh no, I need to go get the bread, I need to go get the eggs, I need to get the bread, I need to get the eggs, I need to get the milk. Oh my god, my old side was just getting worse. This this is the end of me. I blame Donald Trump for this bullshit. I blame Donald Trump and Dr. Fauci for this crap. No one has fixed the problem since March 13th. No one has solved the problem since March 13th, within 24 hours on that day. And what do they do? They sit around and do nothing. Nothing of the norm. They're just telling us, it's okay, we're all in this together, it's going to be a while. It's not going to be a while! I mean, Halloween season is coming next month, and when people do go tree and tree, and people have a, have these fucking Halloween parties, we're all going to lose society anyway, because people are partying because they don't fucking care about the pandemic. Then they're gonna go. Then they're gonna go test themselves to see if they have the fucking COVID, and then people might lose their education. Like I said, lose their education, lo lose future. A further education information to be well, whoever they might be, wherever they grow up, and their job. Because of COVID, I'm sick of it. And I'm still bored to the core. I tried everything and everything in my path to stay calm, positive, and collective from this pandemic. Apparently, I wrote a post on Facebook saying that. Um, I don't know why people complain to me why this pandemic is is becoming to be a big deal for everybody else. All they fucking do is want to be drunk, smoke cigarettes if they have to, do joints and drugs, and to look like fucking, and trying to, um, you won't even believe the other day where I was complaining about society. I was at the school, right? I was trying to listen to my music, plug into my earbuds, saying, mm -hmm, minding my own business. There was a group of fucking children. 
Okay, these are children. They're just sitting on the playground set with with all this going on, and they think now I'm staring at them. Okay, and this and this also goes with the Sargus town management that if you have those teenagers and those young adults acting unusual, tell them to go fuck themselves. Go to a mental institution or go get a makeover. I'm personally getting so sick and tired of these idiots. It's not only them it's the problem. It's everyone else in Saga is telling me, What? Look for... It's like, Look for Frazier, you, you fucking retard! What do you do with those... Listen. I don't care what's going on. Or what what would happen for the remainder of 2020 and onward? All I care about is that if the election, if the COVID, if the pan no, <clears throat> take it back, if the pandemic had lucidly concludes on the night on the morning after the election, or weeks after we have. A 46th president of the United States of America when he's sworn in, or her, <coughs> excuse me, wherever that might be, there's going to be people dancing in the streets. There's going to be people celebrating. Because we need for this, all we have to do is get to phase four. And once we do, that will be the last of it. And apparently, this pandemic, people didn't manage it. I listened to Kiss 108. They say it's September, and they lied. I don't like people who lie or liars. So, my tip for the remainder of the pandemic, be collective and calm and take control of your life and your money. That's all I'm going to say for right now. Stay cool. Fuck COVID. Vlog you later. Peace.